Like most people, you've probably been wondering, will ChatGPT take my job? In February 2023, ResumeBuilder.com surveyed 1,000 US business leaders to see how many companies currently use or plan to use ChatGPT. They found that 49% of companies currently use ChatGPT, while 30% of companies plan to start using ChatGPT. And of those, 85% are planning to do so within the next six months. 48% of companies using ChatGPT say it's already replaced workers, and 90% of business leaders say ChatGPT experience is a beneficial skill for job seekers. Now every week, there seems to be a new breakthrough in AI. With the release of the even more powerful GPT-4, we find ourselves at the precipice of what could become an AI jobs apocalypse. It's easy to get caught up in the fear that our jobs will soon be replaced by machines. But will robots really wipe out our jobs, render our skills obsolete, and take over the world? In this video, you'll discover the real story behind AI and job displacement, and how you can not only survive, but thrive in this ever-changing landscape. First, let's look how far we've come in a remarkably short amount of time. On the 16th of March, 2021, Sam Altman, the CEO of OpenAI, wrote an article called Moore's Law for Everything. In this article, he argues that software that can think and learn will do more and more of the work that people do now. In the next five years, computer programs will read legal documents and give medical advice. In the next 10 years, they will do assembly line work and maybe even become companions. And in the decades after that, they will do almost everything, including making new scientific discoveries that will expand our concept of everything. He concludes that this technological revolution is unstoppable. These smart machines will help us make even smarter machines that'll accelerate the revolution's pace. That sounds a lot like the robots will take over, but luckily most of that is five to 10 years away, right? Sorry, but that's where you're wrong. Roughly one year after Sam Altman wrote that article, on the 27th of March, 2023, OpenAI released a bombshell paper called Sparks of Artificial General Intelligence. They showed that GPT-4 can perform various tasks such as mathematics, coding, vision, medicine, law, and psychology without any special instructions. They concluded that GPT-4's performance is similar to humans, even better in some cases, beating previous models such as ChatGPT. This suggests that GPT-4 could be considered an early version of an artificial general intelligence or AGI system. But that's not all. Have you heard of the technological singularity? This idea is based on the belief that once an AGI system is developed, it could improve upon itself and become exponentially more intelligent, leading to a rapid increase in machine intelligence. But surely that's all fine as long as this intelligence doesn't take on human form, right? I'm sure you already guessed the answer. On the 4th of March, 2023, Figure.ai announced a contender for a humanoid embodied AI. This company with $100 million funding says, Figure is the first of its kind AI robotics company bringing a general purpose humanoid to life, the world's first commercially viable autonomous humanoid robot. On their website, they say that over time, humans could leave the loop altogether as robots become capable of building other robots, driving prices down even more. They say that manual labor could become optional and higher production could bring an abundance of affordable goods and services, creating the potential for more wealth for everyone. Only, I'm just not so sure about that last statement. More and more reports are coming out with dire predictions about the effect AI robots and automation will have on jobs. The happiest day of my life was the day I was activated. There's nothing quite like experiencing life for the first time, right? On the 23rd of March, 2023, OpenAI released a report concluding that 80% of the US workforce could have at least 10% of their work tasks affected by AI. And for 19% of workers, a whopping 50% of their functions could be impacted. The effects will span all wage levels, but higher income jobs potentially face greater risk. They suggest that critical thinking skills will be more important in the future, so it's probably best that you start developing those. In another report released on the 26th of March, 2023, Goldman Sachs predicts that as many as 300 million jobs could be affected by AI. They also say that about two thirds of US jobs are exposed to automation by AI, replacing about 50% of their workload. An even scarier stat is that about 7% of US jobs could be completely replaced by AI. Those are some huge numbers, 
and they're only based on what we know about AI technology today. Of course, this is causing some significant backlash, like this open letter that calls for a pause on AI development for at least six months. Almost 3,000 people, including Elon Musk and Steve Wozniak, have signed. And the number of famous tech bros on the list is growing by the day. But as the well-known futurist Ray Kurzweil said, You can't stop the river of advances. These ethical debates are like stones in a stream. The water runs around them. You haven't seen any of these technologies held up for one week by any of these debates. So how can you go about saving your job from AI? First, start learning about the technology and what it is capable of. You must get uncomfortable and get used to learning new things. There is loads of knowledge available on the internet through online courses. I also really enjoy Twitter for research and of course YouTube for learning. Plus, you can find some awesome online communities like Discord and Slack groups. Remember, those who fail to learn new skills risk being replaced at some point. It's just a matter of time. Next, think about the tasks you do in your job and ask yourself, where am I wasting time and what can AI do faster? Then use AI to increase your productivity to focus on higher level or more creative tasks. This will allow you to outcompete your competitors with your newly found free time. Lastly, focus on creativity and human connections. Human creativity and the ability to connect with others will never be a commodity and specialists who are great at what they do are still going to be needed. So here are four tips that will help you protect your job from AI. Number one, focus on your strengths. Number two, use AI to enhance your skills. Number three, make it a habit to keep up with advancements in AI. And number four, be ready to accept failure and learn from your mistakes. And don't forget the bottom line. It's only a matter of time before weak performers in the job market are wiped out by AI. So get ahead of the trend and start learning more about AI today. First, Sign up for a free OpenAI account and start experimenting with ChatGPT. Then you can watch my video on ChatGPT prompt engineering that'll take you from beginner to expert in just eight minutes.